All right, what is good, everybody? Welcome, welcome to the Spiritual War Room. Today we're going to have Spiritual Court, okay? So how this is going to go is you're going to pick uh, deck one or deck two, and we're going to look into um, maybe a, a crime that you've been accused of, and it doesn't have to be like like some like a real crime, but something that you're being accused of, okay? So even if it's just like uh, gossip or something, if you're being accused of doing something, we're gonna look into that, okay guys? We're also gonna look into what's your actual involvement in this, if you have any. Um, we're gonna look into what you, most, what you need to know at this time, and we're gonna look at possible outcomes, okay? All right guys, I will put the timestamps for these readings down below, pile one, pile two. Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys at your readings. All right, group number one, we are going to look, at, you know, welcome to spiritual court. <laughs> you may take your seats. All right, guys, um, we are going to look into what, what is the, what it, what, what are you being accused of? What are you being charged with? We're going to look into the crime committed. All right. Um, we're going to also look into your involvement and what you need to know at this time and likely outcome. So we're going to pull four cards. I'm going to pull them first and then we'll clarify. Okay. What is pile one being accused of today? What are they being accused of? What is pile one being accused of? What is pile one being accused of, Spirit? This is spiritual court. So, like, if somebody's doing something shady but can't, you know, it's not something that you can take up in, uh, you know, legal take some kind of legal action this is this is going to be what judgment spirit is going to call on on these people okay so what crime is pile one being um uh, being accused of okay so we have the the tower and eight of pentacles okay something at work Something that happened, um, the tower is, uh, shocking and sudden events that happened. Okay. We're going to clarify more. What is your involvement in this? What is your involvement in this? We have the nine of wands, your involvement. Involvement, Pile one's involvement. Got the sun. Okay. <clears throat> what do you most need to know at this time? What do you need to know at this time? Give that one moment to come out like that. Okay. I'm not sure. I was going to say no, no reversal. So yeah, we're just going to leave it like that. Okay. Um, likely outcome, likely outcome, likely outcome. Sorry. I thought one flipped over. Did one flip over? No. Ah, hold on. Making a mess right here. Let's shuffle them. I heard somebody say shuffle them now. Okay. make you feel better okay likely out for outcome for pile one likely outcome for pile one okay let's break this down guys all right um so something that happened at work that's what you're being accused of something something that went down at work so what is it that went down at work What well, went down at work for pile um, one? What's the tower? What's the tower? What's the tower? Okay, so some, something that was um, impulsive, like someone's impulsive actions caused a tower moment. 
at work? What were the actions regarding some kind of investment? Okay, so some kind of... Oh, shit. So you did something impulsively. You invested in something that maybe you were... Yeah, you were warned. You were told to um, to move away from this. Yeah, there's the Eight of Pentacles. You you were um, in. You were told that this investment was not good. You were told to move away from this. Whatever you were told, you. I mean, you had the clarity. You had the clarity and the intuition, because the Queen of Cups talks about intuition. Um, using your intuition uh, to end this and something at work what was it some kind of investment or you know some kind of project you were working on somebody told you it you needed to move away and you chose not to you chose not to and that was I heard spite oh you you you're telling me not to do it. Well, I'm going to do it anyways. And that was reckless. That was impulsive. And now, like, your company, this boss, they're not happy with, yeah, this, they're not happy with your work. They're not happy. They could have been, um, they could have invested thinking that they were going to get some kind of rewards from it. And they're not. But they somebody was warned that they should move away from this. I mean, it doesn't have this. This is what you're being accused of. This is crimes that you're being accused of. Or you could be accusing your no. You heard no. So you were warned not to invest in something. You invested it anyways. Your company, your business, whatever. Um, they could have given you money to, to work on this. And it fell flat. It could be costing the company money with the tower. Like a big... This is a big mistake at work. This is a big mistake at work. I heard government. Ooh, this could be a government um, job. Somebody, you know, that works for the government. I heard White House? What the fuck? <laughs> you know, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> okay, so they're not happy with the, the work that was done. Hmm, okay. You were told that this, whatever was, whatever project or whatever you were working on was deceptive, or you were told that these people were deceptive. You were warned to move away, and they told they told you to move on fast, but you refused. You refused. You. This is stubbornness. Refusing to let go. Refusing to walk away. So that's what you're being accused of, like. Whatever, whatever decision you made cost the company a lot of money, and now they're they're upset. So I guess I had to pick up some stuff real quick. <laughs> okay. Um. So let's look into your involvement. Here we have nine of wands. This is putting up boundaries, like, <laughs> blockages, your involvement, like you were supposed to block someone, your, your involvement, you were supposed to block someone. It's a good thing this is an actual court. <laughs> okay. Um, shit, man. Yeah, you were. You were 
born to walk away. Your involvement. What are the boundaries that you didn't walk away? Hmm. You okay? The refusal. To, oh, because. You put up blockages, like you didn't want to take this advice because maybe you can, oh, you communicated. Nuh uh, no, don't do that. No, no. Maybe you communicated that this should probably come to an end and that created a lot of, a lot of arguing, a lot of fighting within your group. So whoever you were telling, hey, we need it. We need to end this. We need to walk away. Your involvement, like you communicated that this, so like maybe these are your superiors, right? You told your superior, look, this is not a good idea. We need to walk away from this. Whatever it is, it's it's gonna end badly for us. And they start, they like could have like came after you. There could have been a lot of fighting within this group, and that's that's probably why the sun is here. Your involvement is because. You know, even though you could have been involved, you you warned these people. But because these people were above you, do you want to get down? Um, but because you know, maybe these were your superiors, and you were you know overruled, and yeah. Your involvement, you could, you, you were the sun. You were illuminating whatever you discovered. So that's your involvement. So what is it that you need to know? Okay, that's why it didn't want to come. Because if you warn these people and there was really nothing you could do and they just continued to, to do whatever they were doing and you couldn't really do much about it, um... That's why this this uh, Nine of Swords wanted to come in reverse. Like, this is stress and worry, sleepless nights. It wanted to come in reverse, and it was, that's telling you, you don't have to worry about that. Don't sleep well at night, knowing that you're going to be able to sail on to calmer waters, maybe even a new, new job opportunity, okay? So what is it that you need to know at this time? I don't think I need to really clarify. Okay, um... How, you know, somebody wants to know how, how am I going to be able to get out of this? Um, all this manipulation was being watched. I heard communication. So whatever communication you guys were having, whether it was on, you know, over the phone, emails, text, you know, direct messaging. Um, yeah, all this communication was being, was being watched. All the sneaky shit that was going on behind the scenes. We have this Queen of Wands. It could be between this Queen of Wands and this Emperor. There could have been two that were communicating. Trying to sabotage something, someone. All this was being watched. So they were watching these two. They could have been lovers. They were watching these two um, very closely. That's why I want to say the authorities. This is something. Yeah, spirit saying, yep, yeah, that's the truth. Look at that. Look at, I mean, come on. Can't make that shit up. I said, I think the authorities are involved in this one. Spirit says, that's the truth. The justice system is involved. These people thought they could just do whatever the fuck they wanted and that they could get away with it. They they took a leap over that uh, that that cliff and they're 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 going to fall because all their sneaky shit was being watched. These two. Yep. Yep, yep. So, you could be a, um somebody who had to report to this uh, emperor, this emperor or this queen of wands. Yeah, but you're gonna be able to sail onto calmer waters. You can have. You're probably gonna get a new job, a, a job opportunity somewhere else. The likely outcome is the Seven of Pentacles. Whatever. Um, 
I heard this is going to give you the opportunity to follow your passions and whatever you decide to go after is going to bring you um, financial success with the seven of pentacles you're going to be able to grow um, finances doing what it is so you're going to be yeah whatever yeah you're going to have victory okay you're going to have victory there's there's ooh, i heard um with the page of swords um these people could try to pin this on you they could they're gonna i heard yeah these are fast talkers coming in saying oh are they gonna try to throw you under the bus they're trying to decide who can we throw under the bus they're worried they're worried. Yeah, whatever's being communicated through these this message is because these people wanted to throw you under the bus and get you locked up, you know? Wow. Wow. That is some crazy shit. So you're telling them this isn't a good idea. This isn't a good idea. They're like, screw you. We're going to keep doing this. And when they get caught, they decide, we'll blame you. The one that was telling us it's not a good idea to do this. We're going to throw you under the bus. We're going to try and get you locked up because they could have been worried. Like they're trying to, they're scrambling to try to clean up the mess to, you know, to, to come off as innocent as possible but they don't maybe they do know now that all their communication was being watched they were worried and so they were like who can we pin this on they're looking at all the, their options who can we pin this on and they they could have been worried they could have been worried because you were telling them hey this isn't a good idea we maybe we should stop they're like well we'll get we'll get that one locked up I heard discredit. They need to discredit you. Not at once. Yeah, this is. It's like you could have been. You could have been trying to get away and these people were chasing you like, oh, I heard blackmail. Blackmail. They're, they were blackmailing you. Mm mm mm. Likely outcome though, likely outcome. What, um, yeah, seven of pentacles again. You're gonna grow again with the six of swords. You're gonna be able to get away from all this bullshit and um, focus on what it is that you, uh, on the next step of what you wanna do. Yeah, it might be heartbreaking to hear this communication that they were going to throw you under the bus because you could have felt like you were family, like the situation was really stable, that you could trust it. You know, you didn't think that this would fall apart. When you started to realize this isn't a good idea, whatever it is that you guys were doing, this isn't a good idea. You told these people to stop. They didn't want to. They, yeah, they want to throw you under the bus now final message but you're gonna be able to get away from this um i heard you know so if they were blackmailing you you know everything's gonna come out as far as what they were doing yeah um focus on what it is that you are passionate about and it's gonna it's gonna grow to be very abundant for you okay so yeah i you know Hopefully this brought you some support, some encouragement to keep going, to keep um, fighting the good fight, however that may be <laughs> for you. Uh, I don't know what this situation is exactly, but um, yeah, this is your message. So uh, in this spiritual court, it looks like um, spirit is ruling in your favor and whoever um, was going against you is going to go down. Okay, 
so yeah guys i hope this helped in any way that it was supposed to don't forget to like share subscribe and court is adjourned <laughs>